it was just an awful, awful moment for both of us, mm -hmm. for our whole family. Married couple Andrew and Elad wanted to start a new life in the U.S. with their twins. But red tape is making it extremely difficult. You see, Andrew, who is American, and Elad, who is Israeli. I was born in Israel and grew up there in Tel Aviv. Moved to Toronto, Canada together. They each donated their own sperm so they could have children. Now they want to move to the U.S. The problem is immigration officials told them Elad's son is not legally a U.S. citizen since he's born to an Israeli. And then the lady at the window, she asked, do you know who these kids are genetically related to? The U.S. government denies that one of the twins is a citizen. None of it makes sense. It's not right and we know it's not right. For now, the couple is waiting to hear back on the status of one toddler's green card. Rights group Immigration Equality has filed a lawsuit against the U.S. State Department for denying one son's citizenship. The State Department says it does not comment on pending litigation, but says a child born abroad must be biologically related to a U.S. citizen parent in order to acquire U.S. citizenship at birth. We want a healthy, happy family. That's all we really want. How am I going to explain this to him when he grows up? You're different than your brother. He's a U.S. citizen at birth. You are not. I'm Lee Sheps for InsideEdition.com.